Okay, welcome to my third tutorial video of O oh Denny Boy. Um, so today I'm gonna just go over from the beginning to the end and get you some helpful ideas and review what we have done in the pets tutorial videos. Okay, now let's look at the beginning. The prelude on your right end. You have that little switch there. Now what do you have? You have that ledger line, our chords, ooh, and you have the rear slur doing that. What you're gonna remember is to bring your thumb to G, G. okay? Bring your thumb to G, that's all you're gonna remember. Once you have it safely there, the rest will be smoother, okay? So practice this jump. A lot. Okay. What do you have with your left hand? So left hand, play left hand with pedal. Pedal change. 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 Okay. So when you have the left hand half note, you have plenty of time to go get ready because you're holding that note with pedal, okay? So when you're gonna worry about your right hand um, thumb, before you worry about it, you're gonna be already ready for that A bass, okay? So it's gonna be... Does that make sense? Hold the pedal, go get ready, all right? Now let's look at another A measures there. Look at measure five and six. Measure five and six, because this is uh, somewhat straightforward here. Five and six, the left hand, you're gonna have this. Stay, uh, make, make your thumb stay between A and B here. Okay, so hold it there, and then hold it there, this is measure six, come back to A, okay? Do some little expansion there, and you're gonna find easily this, two, one, or five. Let's play from measure three. Ready, go. Okay, so there's our favorite Lavender's Blue pattern at the end. Now we're gonna look at another five measures or so. And this is quite difficult because you have a lot of jumps. Now let's look at, uh, let's just review separate hands. Um, on measure 10, when you have this, you're gonna get ready when left hand is playing the lavender blue pattern, okay? After the last chord of measure nine, you just come get ready for the six, all right? And then measure 11, have a little contract there. Let it go because your pedal will hold it. Same thing in here, 
You're still in D major chord. And here, B minor. Here, a little switch onto the C sharp. And now here, all you're gonna uh, remember is that you bring your pinky to F sharp. Just like you brought your thumb to G on the prelude, here you're gonna bring your pinky to that F sharp. Okay, the rest is pretty forward. Let's look at left hand. Come back to measure 10, left hand measure 10. Okay, so you're gonna look at that last A of measure 10 in the bass. It's about whether you play this A with your pinky or two. Because if you look ahead, measure 11, you have this. So your two, if your two is already there, it's gonna be a little convenient, right? Also, you don't have to worry about changing the position and changing the page, like looking your sight at the same time. saying so let's try measure 10 and 11 with a pinky on a and then later we're gonna try again with a two on a okay ready oh so you can do this or So decide your fingering on that A in measure 10. Now let's go to measure 12. Measure 12. So you have this. Again. All right. And then you're going to jump to that B minor, which has the F sharp later. And then what are you going to do? You're going to come back to A major finishing on C sharp okay so do plenty of practice on this jump here now let's put them together from measure 10 from measure 10 there you go Eventually they become A. Measure 13, you need this. B on the outer. Okay. And then with D suspension on the right hand, left hand got the chord. And they end on C sharp at the same time. Now, what are you going to think about? bringing your pinky to the F sharp, okay? So I would do this several times. Okay, do this jump several times so that you're used to it and then move on. So your homework will be playing from the beginning to the first chord of 15. Cause just the, from 10 to 14 is being the hardest part of this piece. I want to 
want to see how you're doing and give you some feedback okay so end on this chord and that's gonna be it for the submission okay for this weekend all right have fun